Wait, he's talking to... the treasure hoarders? You know what I'm here for, I trust. Oh, you got lip. Making us guess, are you? If you want to join up, let me just say this first. Dandy kid like you, you ain't welcome. Uh ho -huh. what a commendable imagination. Well, in the Tsaritsa's name, I suppose I should forgive you, country bumpkins, for your ignorance. For I am... brother. That's so cool. I've always wanted to watch you work. Uh, well, why, yes, of course, for I am uh, the greatest toy salesman in Shnezhnaya. Uh, so cool. Huh? You playing games, pretty boy? So, will you buy or not? The toys that Shnezhnaya produced three months ago will run you, yes, 600,000 mora, to be paid in full. Toys? And <laughs> how much money? Wow. Is that what it's gonna cost to fix that head of yours? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! Spreading joy and laughter to everyone! That's what toy selling's all about! I'll say it again. Toys from Shnezhnaya, three months prior, 600,000 mora paid in full. Yeah, no. Sorry, salesboy. The same joke isn't funny twice. Or were you always cruising for a bruising? <sighs> All right then, I'll make things a little easier for you. I'll join the treasure hoarders. Perhaps you'll be more willing to pay when we're brothers in arms? <laughs> Would you listen to yourself? You think we just let any old person into the treasure hoarders? I'm not so sure you could hack it. <laughs> well then, why don't you put me to the test, dear seniors? I like to think of myself as quite talented in the field of treasure hunting. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like you're not gonna pack it up until someone packs you in. Alright then, show us what you got. Truth be told, we've set up a shop here because there's a fine little loot cave nearby. But the treasure hasn't been easy to get at. We've been at it for two days now. If you think you're up to snuff, why don't you have a crack at it on our behalf? Of Course, that means that once you got it, it's ours. Don't try to sneak off with the prize now. <laughs> Come on! If we can't do it, do you really think this guy stands a chance? An initiation test, eh? Interesting. It's been a while since I've been assessed by someone else. The loot's on the opposite cliff. We're gonna hang back here and watch the show. Huh, no problem. Don't blink, though, or you might miss it. Well, I have the goods. Here you go. So how'd I do? Pretty well, I'd say. Brother, what do we do? This fellow isn't normal. Please, hold on a moment, sir. We need to discuss something amongst ourselves. He ain't here for an initiation. He just wanted to show off. Honestly, we'd be no match for him if he wanted a fight. Guys... Do you think that maybe... we're being robbed? I don't know. Surely, he wouldn't have come here all dressed up like that if he was only after us. Unless... maybe his words have hidden meaning. Snezhnaya, three months, 600,000. Oh, I get it. It was insider talk. I remember that the boss took out a 600,000 more loan from that Snezhnayan bank about three months ago, and still hasn't repaid it. So this guy must be the debt collector. But why didn't he just say so? What's with all the toy talk? <laughs> and that's where you're still green. See, in a lot of professions like this, people speak in code to protect the privacy of their business partners and clients. Makes sense. Owing money is pretty embarrassing. This guy isn't one to mess with, I tell you. He's a professional. Way too professional. So, Mr. Salesman, my apologies, but we can't have you joining us. Oh? I didn't pass? I must say, 
I never imagined that the treasure hoarders would have such strict entry requirements. No, it's not that. What we mean is that you're too big a fish for our little pond. But we fully understand the situation with the... Uh, toys, sir. We'll fetch that 600,000 for you right away. <sighs> I see. Well then, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. We get paid, and everyone stays happy. A wonderful outcome, wouldn't you say? Uh, yes. Uh, couldn't agree more, sir. That's my brother for you! Toy sellers are so cool! Ah, Master Child, you're here. A new batch of fresh recruits have just... Hey now, keep your voice down. Can't you see I'm entertaining some clients over here? Clients? Uh, well, anyway, the Motherland has dispatched a new batch of recruits to Liyue. They've just arrived, and I'm afraid we must trouble you to speak to them. Ah, uh, do I have to? Now is hardly the best time. I must apologize for troubling you, Master Child, but they are already waiting for you south of Lingju Pass. Every new batch of recruits must be baptized by the Tsuritsa's will, through the words of her harbingers. This has always been our rule. At present, Master Child, you are the only harbinger in Liyue. Please, everyone is standing in formation and waiting for you to bestow this honor upon them. <sighs> well, all right then, I'll go. Just give me a moment to catch up with my brother, and I'll be right with you. Do you have to keep working? Yes, Tusser. We have a group of new toy sellers fresh in from the motherland, and I need to go teach them the ropes. Wow, that's great! When I grow up, I want to be a toy seller too. Can I go listen? Hmm, I'm afraid you're still too young, Tusser. I'm not sure if you'd understand much of it, and most of it's rather boring anyhow. Why don't you go play with the Traveler instead? Sound good? But... but... I really do have to go now, Tusser. A lot of people are waiting to see me. I'll see you around, alright? Child really dotes on his brother, but now he's got to ditch him again. Must be a really tough job. Yeah, you're right. He hasn't done himself any favors with the whole toy seller cover story. To think he'd go this far just to prevent his family from seeing his dark side. Maybe, but he has good intentions, doesn't he? Wait! Uh, where's Tusser? Ah, uh, we were too busy chatting! Where'd he go? Uh, seems likely. Tusser did seem really eager to hear his brother's speech. Either way, let's head over there first! Yeah. <laughs>